The affordable drill tower is an innovative solution that offers a safe, practical, completely realistic, and extremely affordable alternative to traditional brick and mortar training towers. Starting at less than $55,000, the affordable drill tower can be installed right in your parking lot. Constructed of high strength galvanized carbon steel, the affordable drill tower was professionally engineered as a three story, five level, 34 foot tall, freestanding drill tower. The original concept of the affordable drill tower started as a way for fire departments to obtain ISO credit by having a training tower. Four friends with more than 50 combined years in the fire service, military, commercial construction and engineering industries collaborated to make the affordable drill tower a fully functional training tower for fire departments. The primary focus was to maintain a safe design that would exceed all construction standards. Once this was achieved, we focused on the practicality of the affordable drill tower. The open design allows for instructors and officers on the ground to observe without being in the way. As current and former fire service instructors, we know and understand the challenges that fire departments face. The simple fact is, most fire departments fall into these three groups. Those that don't have access to any drill tower, those that go to a neighboring jurisdiction to use someone else's drill tower, and finally, the few fire departments that are fortunate to have their own drill tower. Why do without or send your firefighters an apparatus out of district? Why be limited by how many times you can train on a drill tower? Why pay rent or be responsible for someone else's drill tower? Now you can train anytime you want, keeping your firefighters and apparatus in your district. Simply walk out the back door of your fire station and go to work. With the exception of live fire training, anything that you can do with a brick and mortar drill tower can be done on the affordable drill tower. We worked closely with a professional sprinkler installation company to custom design the same fire suppression system that you will find in any commercial structure. Starting at the ground level, there is a two and a half inch fire department connection. On the first floor, there are two sprinkler heads with a control valve. Then, we plumbed two and a half inch standpipe valves on the first, second, and third floors. Finally, we added a system pressure gauge at the top of the vertical riser. The fire suppression system allows an engine company to practice, train, and pump on realistic scenarios. Whether it's pumping into the FDC or connecting hose packs to the standpipes, your engine companies can fine tune their skills. Stretching hose lines up multiple levels comes with its challenges. Why practice on the fire ground? The five levels of the affordable drill tower has no shortage of hose line challenges. The optional steel tow boards help to minimize your hose lines from extending off of the drill tower as they expand when charged. How many times have you chalked an active sprinkler head? We have installed two sprinkler heads with a control valve on the first floor. We also added an instructor's platform to the second level, which moves the instructor out of the path of crews working on the drill tower, yet giving a vantage point to give direction. The instructor's platform doubles to simulate an apartment balcony. With construction booming and multi-level residential apartments popping up across the United States, we knew that it was important that ladder companies had the opportunity to practice and train on gaining access to and making rescues from a balcony. In addition to ground ladder operations, the balcony also offers the opportunity to advance hose lines from a ground ladder into a structure. Make your affordable drill tower even more realistic by adding the optional second balcony instructor's platform. Now you can perform simultaneous rescues from balconies on different floors. Consider having the optional window prop installed on your affordable drill tower, which is very similar in size to the window opening in the Denver drill. Now you can enter from a ground or aerial ladder through an elevated window. You can advance a hose line through the window and you can even perform rescues and do window bailouts. Some firefighters have said that this is one of the most valuable pieces of their affordable drill tower. The affordable drill tower has a segmented floor on the first and second floors. The removable floor panels allow you to conduct vertical confined space rescues and allows for you to train and practice the Columbus John Nance drill. Whether you're setting up an Arizona Vortex tripod or use rope rigging, now you can train on elevated vertical rescues in your own backyard. 
with anchor points on every vertical leg, spaced at approximately every 22 inches, there is no shortages of primary and secondary attachment locations. Each connection point has an axial load rating that exceeds 10,000 pounds. From rappelling to Stokes basket operations, the affordable drill tower will allow your rescue companies to perfect their skills and train on a daily basis. The optional vertical ladder with safety cage allows rescuers to train in a vertical confined space shaft. The vertical ladder is fully enclosed in a safety cage and has access from the second floor to the ground level. Practice patient packaging and advancing a hose line vertically. Why risk causing damage to private property when practicing with your aerial ladder? The affordable drill tower is perfect for practicing aerial ladder placement, working from an aerial ladder, advancing hose lines from an aerial ladder, as well as performing rescues from an elevated structure to an aerial ladder. Affordable Drill Towers recently introduced our optional 10-foot outriggers with steel decking. The 10-foot outriggers increase the overall footprint of the affordable drill tower in each direction, making your drill tower 33 feet wide and 38 feet long. On side one, the dual four foot wide by 10 foot long outriggers extend the first floor, giving firefighters more room for stretching hose lines while leaving the center bay unobstructed for rappelling. Sides two and four are both eight feet wide by 10 feet long and each has a segmented floor that is perfect for through the floor or vertical rescue scenarios. Alternatively, the outriggers on sides two and four were specifically designed and designated as the perfect location to build vertical ventilation props. Now you can easily opt for affordable drill towers to construct an eight foot by 10 foot flat roof prop on one side and an eight foot by 10 foot pitched roof prop on the opposite side. Side three is similar to side one and is perfect for ladder operations and acts as an offset mezzanine to the balconies. You can span the two outrigger bays horizontally with a ladder to simulate moving from rooftop to rooftop or spanning load-bearing walls to access a trapped firefighter. Finally, the addition of the outriggers creates a 38-foot long center hallway on the ground level, which adds a new dimension to stretching hose lines and moving equipment. And close your hallway and practice advancing a hose line down a hallway or pushing fire back as you advance. Now your truck company can practice cutting a hole for in the roof simulator for vertical ventilation while your engine company is stretching a hose line and your rescue company is being deployed as an RIT team. The affordable drill tower has become the perfect multi-company training solution that can be installed right in your parking lot. The innovation of the outrigger bays, roof simulators, and window prop has greatly increased the versatility, practicality, and value of the affordable drill tower. The bottom line is, you can't afford not to have an affordable drill tower. For more information or to place an order, please visit our website at affordabledrilltowers.com. Give us a call at 844-55-TOWER or send us a message on Facebook or Instagram. It's much more impressive in real life than it is in video, right? And from a functional standpoint, it's phenomenal. It's one of those things that just screams, what are we gonna do with it today? I like the fact that it's not limited. I also like the fact that there's a focus on the basics, health, water operations, uh, rope operations, access operations. Do you need a brick and mortar tower in every district? Probably not. But could you use a, a affordable drill tower, a tower that you can run basic company level drills through in every district? And I'd say the answer is yes. Having no tower at all and having a tower, if you're a small or a volunteer organization, get the tower. I can't, I can't think of any excuses to not have an affordable drill tower. This is a great product. I think the drill tower is a great training prop. Your only limit is your imagination. We made a window prop here. Uh, we talked about transitioning on a balcony from a tower ladder. You can put a window prop in other places on this drill tower. You can add it to other structures you have, training devices in your department. It just allows you a functionality you can add on to it. So it's really very, very, very dynamic. 
and you can do with it what you want because it's such a great prop. Your imagination is your only limitation. So I could see this being used for any type of department, any size, uh, large, small, urban, suburban, rural. It can be used anywhere because it can be built anywhere. It's an amazing thing that allows you to do these things in the back of a firehouse. The drill here at the affordable drill tower, we did a stamp pipe stretch and it was great because the system can take actual standpipe pressures of up to 150 PSI. So that allowed us to use our gauge and dial in the pressure for the standpipe system to operate correctly, the hose line to function at the correct pressure. So I like the fact that we were doing the realistic thing of getting dialing in the pressures, which is a big deal. The other thing that we were able to do was to use the staircases that are here to replicate real staircases in buildings and, and the tower does that. And one nice thing is that sense of realism is, is great with the tower and the other factor that I liked was the line of sight that the tower provides. I can pretty much see on other floors what's going on that I can't do in a regular building. So it was, it was a good advantage for a, a teacher to uh, be able to see what the students were doing. The one nice thing about the training tower is it can work in urban, suburban, or rural training environments because even though we have differences in buildings, there's commonality to everything we do. Uh, firefighters are gonna go above the first floor. They're gonna, more, more and more firefighters are encountering standpipe systems throughout the country. That is a big deal. That's where the growth in the fire service challenge is in standpipe operations. The tower provides a great standpipe opportunity. Also, just with smaller departments, one of the things that they get have problems with is limited amount of attack hose. So alternative hand stretches are important. You can do those. You can do rope stretches on the tower. You could facilitate all of that into your training every day with the tower being right nearby. It's very convenient, no permission required. So on the affordable drill tower yesterday, and we've done the past couple of days, we've used it to our advantage for techniques involving uh, firefighter survival and rapid intervention operations, including firefighters in the floor, through the floor, taking members in distress out windows, lowering them. This tower does a tremendous job of prepping any department, large, small, volunteer career into those skill sets. Again, we don't use them all the time, but being able to be out here on this drill tower and hone those skills constantly so we have the muscle memory, et cetera, and we don't lose those perishable skills is a huge advantage. And it's immediately available. You don't have to reserve stuff. You don't have to make these arrangements. And as we've seen, we've been able to have multiple companies working at the same time doing different things, but all trying to achieve the same goal. The biggest benefit for us, one was the cost. It was affordable and it allowed us to have training props that we wouldn't normally have. Again, we're, we're limited only by what we can think of to do with it. We use it for a lot of ladder work, a lot of tech rescue work. We've removed a lot of like the floor panels and done a lot of confined space work with it. It's a great foundation for user imagination. What can you come up with and how you can use it? We've done that a lot in the past year. Once we were able to get those outriggers on and engineered, uh, put on all four sides, it just light bulb went off and we were able to do so many more different things with those outriggers from short laddering to uh, building props on the on the side of it uh, for ventilation uh, a longer uh, hallway that we could put in there so yes it did add a great value by, by adding the outriggers we just can't go out and, and build a 20 million dollar burn building but with this it just gives us everything we need to do what we could do at a burn building. With the portable drill tower here on site they can do it on shift anytime they want you know day or night a lot of value to us. The, the tower has allowed us to uh, repel multiple members all at one time from different sides from the same side. We're able to get people confident on rope and we can do it simultaneously while others are doing lowers with Stokes basket we can repel over here and not interfere with anything that anyone else is doing all at the same time. Affordable is the perfect name to put on it because it is an affordable training structure for smaller departments that are on a very limited budget. I've had fire chiefs from other departments come and take a look at it and 
you know, been very pleased with it. Compared to a brick and mortar drill tower, this does everything. You know, it just doesn't have the brick and mortar on the outside. You know, the stairs and everything interior of that is just exactly the same thing you would find at, that, at a much lower cost. You know, we make a huge investment in our people. This was a very cost-effective solution that it allow us to train quickly, be able to use the tower to do different types of training. So when you looked at what it could do for us and the cost, it was a no-brainer. But real world places, real world video. So this is the real world. We just talked about being able to be in district and train. These guys are in district, they get a call, boom. They're not, we're not down at the academy. We're not a cover crew. We're not a crew coming from outside. We're in our district. We're, we're, we haven't left where we should be. I think this is a fantastic opportunity for organizations to, to get an opportunity to do real realistic training at an incredibly good value, an amazingly good value. Photos don't do it justice. If you get a hold of Steve and Chris and they'll let you know where there's one near you or heck, they'll, they'll come bring you one.